What's up, Facebook? It's Chad. It's been a while. Let's see if I can still remember how to do this. Try to turn on comments here. And yeah, we'll figure that out as we go. I'm out here doing a little bit of practicing. I see Bruce is on there. Hey Bruce, throw up a comment. Make sure I can see you there. <laughs> to do um, got some writing to do with uh, my band accelerate and uh, we've got band in a barn kicking again uh, we've got a bunch of videos coming for that uh, a lot of it's already recorded not a lot of it some of it's already recorded so we're gonna get all that edited out and get it to you guys as quick as possible there we go hey dad yeah I just got a new phone trying to figure out how to see comments on here I see when you guys pop on but I'm not seeing comments yet so we'll uh, just play around a little bit if I'm not seeing comments I'll try to figure it out again but uh, I'm just gonna start playing and hear anything you want to hear or uh, I can't talk if you want to hear anything we're live now I'm not live later tonight I'm not live tomorrow I'm live right now that's the whole live thing so. If you want to comment, comment now. that I lost the clamp on my phone. let's see if I can get that back on there there we go a little crooked red rocker okay we can do some red rocker we just did red rocker <laughs> snow tonight. Yeah, that's Michigan for you. I saw Triumph in there too. Um... <laughs> Doesn't play walk this way. 
Um, I hope you know Rat doesn't play walk this way, but right. Aerosmith does a pretty good job of it. <laughs> I didn't switch to lefty. That's just how the camera does that, buddy. Because um, it's the forward-facing camera on the iPhone. So it projects everything backwards. So I'm not actually left-handed. I cannot play left-handed. I actually swung a golf club left-handed this year. I actually hit the ball, which I normally don't do with my right-handed clubs. Which is kind of cool. <laughs> should there's I, man it's right in the back of my head oh Ethan wants to hear Eminem okay <laughs> what happens. I'm just a gigolo. Nope. That ain't happening either. <laughs> Bye. 
Snakeskin Cowboys. Bust out of Les Paul is like first thing I play. Let's see. Oh, my God. 
you guys. Allison Chains already did that. NWA. Yeah. Um, I know a lot of words to NWA, but I don't think I'm going to do that here. Uh, no, Phil. That's the, uh, my EVH 50 watt down here. It's kind of hard to see, but it's down there. Molly Hatchet. Like a... missing that Brian I'm in California
Justin to win. Really? All right. I don't know if I remember it. I, I mean, this part. Here. Son to open the third set with. Depends on what band I'm playing with. Um, there was a really cool tune that we did this summer on the lake, and I've been wanting to play it for years, and we finally did it. And it actually turned out pretty good. I was actually quite surprised because as easy as the song sounds to play, some of the timing in it's pretty messed up. Um, yeah. But it goes something like this. <laughs> The intro is awesome, but it's uh. <laughs>
don't know any hailstorm. Sorry, Allison. Death Leopard. Okay. Which one? It's a lot. I always play this one just because I love it. I know.
Let's see. Yeah, acoustic could be cool. Some whaling, why not? Free bird, no bird. Incubus, drive. Yeah, I used to play that actually. Um, just gotta remember it. Uh... One song everybody knows and loves, but nobody knows the name of. You know which one I mean. No, I don't at all. But if I had to guess, but many people know this tune, but like they probably heard it, don't know who it's by. And if they really knew anything about the band that it's actually by, and they bought their stuff from before, a little interesting, let me just say. But uh, actually, Steve Lukather helped write a lot of this album, I believe. But um, Here's one that I like. on top of that when I'm playing the rhythm. So I'm, instead of just going... <laughs> Drive that back from Hawaii. Nice. Let's see what else we got here. <laughs> Spark it up. <laughs> I don't even think I played that anywhere near the way you played it. I try. 
Joe Satriani. Oh, yeah, okay. <laughs> to what I was trying to do before, which is actually practice some of the tunes that I gotta start learning. Who am I kidding? <laughs> <laughs> stage the same size as like a watch just a little bit too big so I got a mini mini rotovibe that actually works off of touch tempo so I can do a slow sweep I'll play 
played Tesla. Never mind. <laughs> I played some Dio. Let's see. Hey, who's winning the World Series right now? Tell me, Jennifer. But out in the barn. I don't have TV out here. I do. Just not cable. Actually, uh, what effects units are you using? All I'm using, actually, is um, into my effects loop. Here, I'll play it dry for you. Um, that's just the EVH 5150 51. Um, I use just a little bit of reverb, a little bit of delay, tiny bit of chorus. So you'll hear... That's it. If I want to play some more classic type rock stuff like the Stones and stuff, I'll put on a little bit more of a slapback delay. And I'm actually just driving. There's no overdrive kicking right now. I'm just driving it through the uh, through the front end with my pickups on my guitar. Right and then for my overdrive tones, uh, it's a triple channel amp. Uh, channel two, the blue channel, is just me. Um, I'm on, my gain's on halfway right now. But, just using the volume knob, I can clean it right up. you really want to have two separate overdrive channels uh, but I use it as a lead channel I just turn the gain way back down on it so the gains probably at about I'll put it right at 930 <laughs> I start doing this more let me know uh throw some comments up and something you guys want to see i'll start doing it more thanks guys have a great week